Yo, what is going on everybody? Welcome back to another video here on Akuma MC. And in this video, we're going to be leveling up our armor. So let's just get straight into it. First thing we're going to be doing is applying armor stones to our armor. And one thing I totally didn't know is you can actually put, you can actually combine armor pieces to level up your current armor. So let's go do that real quick. So if we take a look at our legendary helmet right here, that's level eight. And we take this one, we can actually apply it and it should go up some progression. So let me keep doing that. Token boost percentage is actually going up, I just saw. So as you can see for my leggings, it's 0 0.6. If you apply 1.4 and yeah, it's not going to go up a lot once you've already got a decent amount. But yeah, so now I've combined all my token armor. So let me go apply some armor stones on them. I should have a bit. Yeah, so I have nine here and yeah, none of my other PBs. So right now we have, right now we have three level eights and a level seven. So let me take all my armor. Okay, so I'm apply some to this one. Okay, and that's level eight now. Now I'm just gonna apply them for all to be level nine. Boom, they're all level nine. And I'm just gonna do that one more time. And boom, now I, all my armor pieces are level 10. So they should be giving me a 2% token boost, which is pretty good. But we're also gonna be doing some other progression like our pickaxe and ranking up. As you can see, we are ranked 200 finally. So our mine is bigger and we did get a lot of stuff with that. So yeah, and we do have 33 trillion tokens. We can actually spend and my pickaxe is level 95. So let me check if that actually got me a new enchant. Yeah. We have Napalm Strike, unleashes a Firestorm on the mine, granting tokens. Each third level increases the amount of Firestorm spawn, and it is a token's enchant, so it would be good to mag it would be good to apply. But we can only get 25 levels, so let me just get five levels for now. And before I get any other enchants, let me claim my milestones real quick. So we have some caches in this one, and 16.5 trillion in that, and then some more caches. So we're gonna open up those, and now we have 45 trillion tokens. I want to put some on Meteor Shower, so let me go. I can only get 21 levels, so let me just claim those real quick. Boom. Yeah, and I'm gonna go and spawn and actually open these. I do have a ton. So I'm put I'm gonna put down all these caches and then I'm gonna open up these these vaults. Should get a lot of tokens from these actually. So we can we're gonna be able to max out our pickaxe a lot more. And I'm probably gonna salvage a lot of this. So slash salvage shop. And basically from salvage, you're gonna get salvage points, which you can actually use, which you can use to buy other things like armor boxes and stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna claim those 37 right there. And I do have another cache in these two epic armor boxes. And we did get boots, so we're gonna apply those. Boom. And okay, these leggings are kind of useless. But let me open open up these skin boxes. I haven't yet to get one, but boom, we just got the eye level one. So we're definitely gonna take that and we got Reaper level one. Let me actually go check what those do. So what do we get? We got the eye, spawns an eye shooting laser at your mind. So we're probably gonna equip that one let me see what the reaper does first open to portal uh yeah we're gonna keep the eye on for now i don't know which one's better but let's just keep this one on for now and i'm gonna open up these last two caches and we'll go back to the mine and okay hopefully some tokens we get and okay two more caches i'll just open up those real quick and okay we got some kind of useless stuff we don't really use drills or anything so yeah let's open up these some arm boxes and stuff okay we're just gonna salvage all those skin box buy that another eye okay let's go back to the mine it would have been good if we did get some armor stones from that two out to max out our armor even more but unfortunately we didn't but we do have a pretty decent set going so far it was level 10 but it is better than nothing and it is legendary and mythical so we'll definitely take that over the rare and common rarities because it is a lot better one thing i forgot to check is actually the battle pass i haven't claimed any of these but it does not seem like we have a lot but we do get a pet egg and five pickaxe levels or no that's for the paid one but for the free one we get five bronze mystery vaults so we're gonna quick oh we're gonna quickly open up all of those and hopefully we get some armor stones or something like that or maybe some just tokens but let's see and okay i don't think we got anything that good maybe some tokens but not that much there are only the bronze cash so they're not gonna be as good as like gold i just salvaged a few more things so let me check how many points i have and I have 181 so if we go to the salvage shop we're going to be going and buying one of these mythical armor boxes. I think they added a few more things, actually. But yeah, let's go ahead and buy one of these mythical armor boxes. Open that up real quick. We're hoping for some token armor because right now we only have the legendary rarities. And we got some key boost. We got some key boots. I mean, we'll take it. Not the best. We might honestly salvage that later. Yeah, that's what we're going to basically do with our salvage points. Whenever we get stuff we don't want, we just salvage them. And then I'm going ahead and buy some of these mythical armor boxes and hope that I get a mythical token piece. But right now I only have one is that's and that's the boots. So we are hoping to get more in the future to help level up our set. Pretty sure if we go on IH, we can actually look and buy some armor, but it should I think it does cost a lot. 
Let me try to find where the armor will be at. Okay, it's in the PvP section. And yeah, there's the the highest rarity. It's actually the masterful rarity, not even mythical. But as you can see, it costs 350 trillion tokens around for one of them. So it is pretty expensive. We don't have that kind of tokens. I mean, we probably could get up to like 100 trill, but that is just way too far from us right now. And okay, if I don't. I want to try to find a legendary. I don't know if there is any listed. Okay, there is one listed for 100 trill. So that is honestly not worth it because there is a one here listed for Roger Cho and it's masterful. I'm kind of tired of mining right now. So we're using some grenades and this art and this plasma torch to mine faster. Like as you see, this torch just obliterates the mine. So we're going to be using that for now. I mean, it does mine pretty weird. So if you do slash mine reset, honestly, spamming these grenades are like really fun. Like they just explode like the whole mine, especially the legendary ones. And you only need like one of those to explode the whole mine, actually. So they are honestly the best. They're honestly really good. But for the rare ones, I just pin them around everywhere. And the mine resets after I break a certain amount of blocks. But yeah, let me actually, I probably won't be able to reset it because I have been mining it. Uh, let me try to break enough blocks to actually get it to reset. And I want to test out a legendary one. So we are level 210. And I just want to see if the whole thing will break again. Because in our previous mines, a legendary one did break the whole mine. And I do want to test that again to see if that happens. Okay, the mine should be resetting anytime now. As that is pretty destroyed. Okay, boom. And so we're just going to go towards the center of mine down a little bit. And we're just going to throw down this legendary grenade like that. And it should explode the whole mine or pretty close to the whole mine and boom as you can see i mean if we put it a little bit lower it probably would have exploded the whole mine so yeah the legendary grenades are honestly insane they're honestly fun if you don't want to keep mining just get yourself some grenades and just keep doing them down they're really fun to use honestly they're more fun than just regularly mining to me but we did get a milestone so this should give us a decent amount of tokens let me find it was the block category and that is 18 trillion tokens so we will take that and we do have 60 trillion tokens right now we can actually apply on our pickaxe so we're probably gonna put that on a decent enchant i'm thinking okay we don't have gold mine max yet we could put 60 levels there or we could go for something like meteor shower or maybe even cluster bomb i think i might just go for gold mine because we do need to max out our token enchants and that is a pretty good enchant to max out when it does apply and stuff like that so yeah that was a pretty good use of money right there and once i do get the maxed out i'll probably go for other things drag hammer and all that i'm just really focused on the token enchants because the tokens are the main thing that i need on the server and as you see i'm already back to about three trillion tokens so we are getting tokens pretty decently fast and that's thanks to our armor and our pickaxe because those are the main things that are giving us boost on the tokens and as soon as we as we max out our armor we are going to be getting a ton more tokens also so keep that in mind right the armor the more tokens we're going to be getting and as soon as we get like armor stones and all that, we're just going to be mainly focusing on maxing out our armor. That is one of the main things that are going to help us. But as we do that, we're going to be, we're going to progress our pickaxe and our mine. We are almost at level 220. And once we get there, our max, our mine is actually going to expand a little bit more. And let's see, our pickaxe is level 97. So once we do get all the token enchants though, and all that stuff, we are going to be focused on the prestige merchant. I think that's what it's called. We check prestige fighters, what it's called. We're going to be focused on a prestige finder because we do need gems. And as you can see, we only have like 900 gems, which is not good at all because the lowest enchant for the gem section is actually 350, but for this one, it's 1 million and we have nowhere near that. So yeah, we need to focus on that after we get a decent amount of tokens and get a decent level on our token enchants. Just notice we unlocked a tier nine pouch. So let me open up that and that's 22 trillion tokens we just got. So we're going to go ahead and apply that on okay we did get gold mine a decent level so we may focus on uh, i want like an enchant like meteor or something let me see we get 97 jackhammer but i think our jackhammer is doing pretty decent so far so let's go ahead and apply some on meteor shower why not eight levels like that it does cost a pretty good amount to actually level up the meteor shower enchant but it is all worth it when it does apply and when it does prog and as you can see that right there is actually our skin the the eye skin going and that's what it basically does and we did, we did just get rank 220, so we'll take that. And every like time it ranks up and mine expands, I think the blocks change, which is pretty cool. And it makes it not as boring. And I am doing a Colossal Crate giveaway, so make sure to go and comment your IGN and like the video to enter that. And good luck to everyone who enters because it is a pretty good crate and you get pretty good stuff from it actually. So make sure to join that. We give it, I'll be picking the giveaway in a few days, so stay tuned. But I think that's where I'm going to wrap things up. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to like and subscribe for more future videos and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.